Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm just drinking water, which is a really rare occurrence for me, but I felt like I was going to pass out, so here we are. Some lemon in a straw. I don't, I don't know. I honestly felt so awkward today making an intro, so I was like, maybe if I hold something, I'll feel less awkward. I don't know. I'm just going to put it down now. Yeah, anyways, aside from me feeling really awkward today, I don't, I don't know. It's like weird. I feel like I don't want to film today, but I want to anyways, so... Uh, my last video was a Killstar haul kind of thing, and this time I'm going to do just literally I'm showing you two things that I got from a store called Rogue and Wolf, which is kind of of the same style and everything, and I was so excited when I got this order last night. I like worked until midnight, and then my mom picked me up, and I got in the car, and she's like, look what came in the mail, and I was like, yes, oh my god, because I was waiting like two-ish weeks for it or something. So of course I did already open it because I was impatient, but I did want to show you guys the super duper awesome packaging. It just says hashtag Rogue and Wolf, and then something about the Rebels, Witches, and Bitches, which is cool, and then they have like, I think it's supposed to be a bat. You can see it better on this side like a bat face and it's really really cool so yeah I gotta love the sick packaging I am honestly like so sorry that I never do like proper like unboxing like waiting to film and like open it in front of you guys but there's just no way I get so excited when I open mail I have to open it like right then I cannot wait especially since last night it was like midnight when I got this so there's no way I was gonna wait <laughs> but it's like I said I just got two items and I've already been wearing them because I like I'm obsessed with them so this first one um, is this awesome like crop top hoodie that has this white striping down the side and it says we can hang if you bring your cats which is so so good for me I freaking love cats and I don't like socializing unless there's cats involved so it has this cute like skull cat thing on the turtleneck collar and then also one down here as well and one of the things that I really super loved about this which is like super unique is that first of all the hood is like humongous like it's like a big huge like witch hood and it has this awesome like teal color on the inside which is like so random I feel like like I've never really seen like in terms of like goth or alternative fashion to just have like a random pop of color in like a hood like that I feel like that's super awesome um, I'm already like completely obsessed with this I put it on last night it was taking a bunch of selfies and I slept in it been wearing it all day today and then here we are showing you it on camera so I'm just now realizing this also has a really sick tag I don't know what it is with like awesome goth companies making sick tags and everything, but this one says Rogue and Wolf, this is what spells are made of, the roganwolf.com, and then it has some awesome little symbols. I just freaking love that extra little touch, it makes it so much more authentic and I love it. So, uh, so this time I'm going to try everything on at the end because there's just two things anyways, so I'll just go ahead and show you the next item. Uh, so this is a dress, which is amazing, and it says uh, which hashtag elf, which I so loved especially because I have like Lord of the Rings tattoos and stuff and I love fantasy things but I also like wearing all black and being kind of gothic. I, I'm not really a goth chick but I do like the aesthetic of it so I just thought that this was super super duper awesome. This dress is pretty short. I did try it on last night. Um, it kind of comes down into like a V cut at the front and as well um, the sleeves which are apparently kind of tangled here, I don't really know, I'm so bad at videos. Also has kind of a pointed little sleeve, which you'll see when I wear it, and it does have the turtleneck kind of thing as well, and then kind of this harnessy, strappy bit on the front. It's kind of hard to see because everything's black, but you'll see when I put it on, so it's fine. Pretty much the extent of the two items that I got, um, I think they're super cute. Um, the more black, the better. It's just so good. Yeah, anyways, I'm just going to go ahead and try those two things on for you, kind of show them, model them, whatever, all that stuff. So uh, this is the first item, the little crop top hoodie thing, and I'm just wearing it with some leggings because that's what I was chilling in anyways. So um, like I said, it has an awesome like turtleneck kind of thing, which is super new to me. I've never ever worn a turtleneck, but I totally am digging it, especially with the little cat thing here. Um, the only complaints I really have about this... Um, the sleeves are kind of like short, they're kind of meant to do that though because that's like what it looks like on the model and everything. Um, and I'm like the kind of person who would probably like it to be longer where I can kind of hold it or if it even had like little thumb holes or something, I'd probably like that. I just feel like it's kind of awkward when like a shirt is like 
short. It just looks like it doesn't fit you, but that was how it was supposed to be cut, I'm pretty sure. Um, the other thing is that it's kind of loose on like the crop part. I probably would have liked it better if it was like tighter um, around kind of because it just feels kind of like awkward or something, but it's fine. I love it. Um, so the hood is super duper big, like I had mentioned. Um, it's almost too big, but I, I like it. It's really, really cool. Um, so when you put on the hood, it's kind of sometimes hard to position it where it looks nice. Like I don't know how far to pull it, but yeah, um, it's really cool. I really like the blue. I think it's a nice, nice touch to kind of make it a little bit different. And overall, I just really, really love it. Um, the hood is kind of attached like all the way across the back which is interesting it's like very different i've never seen a hood like this but it gives it the very like wide hood effect absolutely just digging it so much i really really love it um, i'm going to be wearing this a lot i definitely definitely know that that's going to be a thing So um, this is the next item, which is the dress, which holy, I am so obsessed with this harnessy, strappy little bit here. I will point out that this part here, like these two little ones coming up, and this strap and this strap are my bra, so that is not part of it, but I think it totally like works with it and looks good and everything. I am loving it so, so, so much. And again, the witch hashtag elf thing is just friggin' perfect, I think. I was saying the uh, arms do kind of have these like pointed sleeves. I don't really know how to explain that, but they are super nice. I really love them again. It's like they're kind of short, which is like weird, but cute. I don't know. It's just, it just feels like I want to pull it down or something, but like I'll get used to it once I wear it a little bit more. Um, the dress is very, very short. Um, it does come down to a point at the front as well, which is probably supposed to be centered. Um, the back is like even shorter than the front. It's going to be definitely something I'll have to constantly be pulling down like all day, especially like, I don't know about you guys, but when I wear a skirt or a dress and I'm like walking, I'm like convinced that it's like completely just like come up to like my mid back and that everyone can just see my butt. So I'm like, Literally, like, at all times, I'm like, oh god, oh, oh god, no, nope, is it there? <laughs> you know, um, I really do like having a dress that is actually uh, with my fashion style sense and everything because the main thing for me, which I did mention in my last video where I did my Killstar haul, uh, dresses and skirts just make me feel really uncomfortable. It's like I'm too feminine, but because this is, like, dark enough and, like, edgy enough, I actually do feel like I'll wear it because I, like, it kind of counteracts the... Uh, cute, pretty, girly thing. I don't know if that makes sense. I just have it on with some combat boots because that's pretty much all that I ever wear anyways. really, really love how you can see my thigh tattoo kind of peeping out there. Um, it's a spirit healer from World of Warcraft, but any excuse in the summer for me to show that off, I'm definitely going to be doing that. So yeah, I super duper love the dress so, so, so much. I'm really excited about everything. My camera has two minutes left of storage on it and I don't want to run out so I'm going to quickly end this. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I know it was super duper short and just like, hey, here's two things, boom. Um, but I was just really excited about them and I figured why not just make a video about it. I thought you guys might like it too since I seem to be getting a lot of love on my Killstar videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. Sorry for being a little bit awkward today. Um, I just sometimes feel weird like that. Mental illness stuff. Ah. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, comment, all that good stuff. And, um, and check out my links to all my other social medias down below. And I hope you all have a wonderful, lovely, lovely day. Bye, guys.